That's integrate t times sine squared t. Well, one of the formula says for sine squared t, we can write this as 1 half times 1 minus cosine of 2t. This way, you see, the power becomes just to the first power, and then this is much easier to handle. So we can look at this integral as the product of t times that. Since the 1 half is just a number, I can take it outside of the integration sign. 1 half integral t times this parentheses, and we can distribute the t already. So t times 1, which is t. And then t times this is minus t cosine of 2t inside. OK, dt. OK, so here we have 1 half. And let me open the parentheses for the integral of this. To integrate t is pretty easy because that's t squared over 2. No big deal. And how can we integrate this? t times cosine 2t. We have to use integration by parts. And let me show you with the di method. So I'm going to put down the d and the i right here. And here this is negative t squared. So later on, you have to make sure you are going to distribute the negative, OK? I mean, negative t times cosine. Anyways, let's get to work. I'm going to differentiate the t, integrate cosine 2t, and don't forget the plus minus plus minus. Differentiating t, we get 1, and then one more time, get 0, so we stop. Integrate cosine 2t, we will get 1 half sine of 2t. And then let's do it again, because we need the equal number of rows. We will get negative 1 over 4 cosine of 2t. Make sure you divide by the, the 2 every single time, because you're integrating, OK? All right, so the product of the diagonals are going to give you the answer already. So we will get t times that. So let's put on 1 half first. We have the negative, though, OK? So we have 1 half t times sine 2t. And then one more. This is negative times negative, so it becomes positive. Plus 1 times 1 fourth, so it becomes just a 1 fourth. And we have cosine 2t. Phew. Well done. So now let's see what can we do with this. We will, of course, have to distribute the negative into the parentheses here and here. And then we also have to distribute the 1 half into everything. So let's do it together and do it carefully. 1 half times this is t squared over 4. OK. And then we have to do 1 half times this. And that's minus. So it's minus 1 over 4 t sine of 2t. Lastly, we have 1 half times negative times positive 1 fourth. So it becomes minus 1 over 8 cosine of 2t. And we are done. So put a plus c right here.